everybody, it's Johnny and Deb. We're the Carnivore Caveman Keto Couple. Welcome back to the channel, guys. So hey, we're just at our local hot spring here in Steamboat and thought, ah, we're leaving. Let's do a little video. Strawberry Hot Springs in yeah. Steamboat Springs, Colorado. If you come to Steamboat, you got to check out Strawberry Hot Springs. Click the link below and you'll see a video. Yeah, and check out these pictures. Ooh, I'm sitting on snow. Fine. Okay. Okay. <laughs> it's really cold. So the topic today, guess what it is? Jillian Michaels. Kiss, kiss my kiss abs. abs. <laughs> yeah, so okay, if you don't know who Jillian Michaels is, she was one of the trainers on The Biggest Loser, which you know, was a big hit show. I think it was on like twelve seasons. I don't know. Um, but I love Jillian. I she was more of a drill sergeant, you know, Bob was kinda like the good cop Jillian was a bad cop um, really pushed people had a lot of success so we thought yeah. weight loss on that show people lost hundreds and hundreds of pounds but guess what 95% of them gained it all gained, back and then some and that's why they don't have a reunion show you guys and this is why we're doing a video Jillian Michaels got on YouTube and other whatever yeah, and, and trash keto so I can only imagine what she would think of carnivore right. she was saying you guys she was saying that keto it, it's dangerous to put your body into a state of emergency you know it doesn't work long term she just had all these negative things she was very ill-informed on keto in in what yeah. the body does you know she still believes that if you lower your calories and just don't eat too much and Calorie you work out six hours a day who has time to do that right you're gonna lose weight well right. yeah if you stick people in a box and don't feed them and make them you work out six hours a day like they did on The Biggest Loser, right, they're right. gonna lose weight, but they gain it back because that's not the real world. Yeah, and, and here's a thought. Yeah, maybe you can do that to jumpstart and lose a bunch of weight, but keto or carnivore after The Biggest Loser right. would have been fantastic. Yeah, because you know, this, this whole weight loss thing, guys, it's about sustainability, right? It's about keeping this weight off and staying healthy. It's not about just losing weight for one month and then putting it all back right. on. Who wants to do that? Lifestyle. But that's what happens on Weight Watchers and all these other, you know, uh, Jenny Craig and stuff. They lower your calories. Who wants to buy prepackaged food yeah, for the rest of your life? Yeah, that has all those chemicals life, right? in it. I mean, that's just dumb. No but once again, you guys, Jillian owns a lot of companies that have to do with like weight loss, she sells these fat blocker pills that I think you can buy at like Walgreens. Fat burner, fat no, burner. No, fat blocker, yeah, they actually block kind, the fat. Yeah, she's of. part owners in that soda stream, so. She's a good a entrepreneur, but yeah, yeah. I, don't, I, I don't trust her anymore. I lost a lot of, she lost right. a lot of credibility. Exactly. And we've got some doctors, check out these videos, Dr. Ken Berry. Yeah, he's awesome. Dr. Berg and Dr. Boz. Yeah. They're all gonna defute or, or dispute yeah. what she said and kind of debunk what she said and explain why she's just ill Yeah, and I'm sure she totally hates carnivore. She never said anything about carnivore, but if no. she thinks keto's bad, you know, because your body needs carbohydrates to survive. Right, right. She's really going to hate carnivore, but, you know, whatever. Like I said, she lost credibility in my book nutritionally. And I think one of the reasons we wanted to do this is don't watch her and go, oh, man, Jillian, you know, she, she knows what she's talking yeah, about. Yeah, don't second guess yourself. Watch the doctors, you know, let them explain. And if you're starting on keto or carnivore, keep it up because it, it is awesome. Yeah. It is awesome. It is great. And I think it's going to be great for longevity. And I think people are going to be able to keep this weight off because on carnivore and keto, you don't have the craving, cravings that you do on these, you know, higher carb carbohydrate right. restricted calorie diets. And I just did my 54 year old ab reveal video. Yeah, sure Check it out. That. Click that link. Here's a picture. It took a lot of work, I'm not gonna lie. It took some dedication, but I did it, and uh, I proved that 54 years old, you can have six pack abs, and I plan on keep, I, they're gonna get better, you know? Right. Now my next goal is work the legs and the booty and, you know, help Deb with her six yeah. pack reveal. I turned 48 on April Fool's Day, so I have two and a half months to get in the best shape yeah. of my life, so we're gonna focus on me now a little yep, bit. exactly, and, uh, so yeah, if you're thinking about carnivore or keto, do your research. Do check your... out these doctors, and and you guys, it does work, and it's just, and it's safe. I mean, you know, when we're first born, for the first 48 hours, we are running on ketones. Ketones right. are a fabulous fuel to run on. No matter what anybody says, it doesn't put your body in a state of emergency. It's not unhealthy. Um, yeah, that's just craziness. Yep. I, it made me so mad when I saw the first video, and then everybody's it, doing them now, and so we feel like we have to put our two cents right. into. 
and, and it wasn't that she had doubts. Or, she was very condescending yes. and called it dangerous. Yes. And clearly she's misinformed. And She didn't do her research on this one, Jillian, so, so we need to start researching. So Johnny has a theory. I have a theory. I think she's doing this just to become relevant again. And next thing you know, there's going to be a Biggest Loser calorie restriction, keto. Yeah, can you guys imagine Thomas DeLauer with the keto group? Thomas, Jillian make Michael this happen. With the yeah. high carb group. I mean... Hey, stranger things have happened. Britney Spears did a comeback like yeah. that. So hey, you never I want to help with the Thomas DeLauer side because I think keto is going to just kick butt. And carnivore, you put carnivore in there too. What a great social experiment. Yeah. Calorie restriction, keto, and carnivore. Have three different groups and see who does well and see who keeps the weight yeah, off. Yeah, see who doesn't have to exercise eight hours a day right, and see who right. keeps it off for sure. Because, you know, that that's the name of the game. Anybody can lose weight, but can you keep it off? That's... That's key. That's the holy grail right there. Can you make it a lifestyle? Right, right. So, hey right. guys, if you like the video, give us a thumbs up. It doesn't cost you anything. Hit that bell notification. It'll let you know when Johnny and I put up a new video. Subscribe. Yep. And remember. Meat heals. Keep eating lots of meat. And get to your local hot spring. <laughs> <laughs>